Captain Lady, sing this song. Do not. Hi, my name is Jenny McLaren. I'm a chorister with the Vancouver Chamber Choir, and I'm joined today by two wonderful composers, Jenny Lee and Kathleen Allen. And we're here today to talk about the Vancouver Chamber Choir's upcoming concert, Youth and Music, which is happening this Friday, May 6th, at Ryerson United Church. To let you know a little about the concert, it features a variety of works by up-and-coming young choral composers who have submitted their works to the Vancouver Chamber Choir's Young Composers Competition, which happens every two years. There are three competition levels. There's uh, elementary school composition, secondary school composition, and university level composition. And Jenny, great name by the way, <laughs> Same as yours. is a finalist in our secondary school composition category. Congratulations Thank first of you. all. Um, now, how did you get involved in the competition and what inspired you to, to submit your piece? Well, I was googling and searching around for opportunities to um, learn about and compete in uh, competitions related to music because I love music writing and so I was inspired by a poem written by a friend of mine actually it was about clouds and it just reminded me of um, times when I was young and I used to sit on the grass you know and just stare up at the sky looking at the clouds for the sake of looking at them and I just thought it felt so pure and innocent so I just wanted to capture that in a piece of music it's a choral competition, so mm -hmm. I thought that was really cool because I usually write for the piano. So I thought, hey, it's time to try something new, you know? And so, yeah, I decided to challenge myself and try something new. Oh, fabulous. Because Fantastic. you never know, right? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. Well, we have Kathleen Allen here, and Kathleen is actually a colleague of mine. We sing together in the chamber choir. Mm. But you actually started um, your relationship with the choir previous to joining through some of the choir's educational programs, like the Young Composers Competition and our Focus program yeah. as well. Actually, when I was in first year at UBC, um, I was in the choir there, and, and I applied to do the focus program where different universities send quartets or small groups to sing in one concert with the chamber choir so that was my first time ever meeting and working with John and meeting all of you very intimidating singers <laughs> and but it was a really really positive experience and uh, and then the following year I entered the composition competition and uh, my piece in Paradisum was in the the university college category and then this year, as a previous winner, I've been commissioned to write for the Chamber Choir. And now I'm a full-time member. So it's been a real progression over four years. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. So can you tell us a little bit about your commission, which is entitled Like Barley Bending? Yes. Yes. Well, um, John originally asked for a piece that would be based on the theme of youth and music, which is the name of the concert. Mm -hmm. And um, uh, I decided to try and incorporate both. And most of the piece is the, a poem by Sarah Teasdale entitled Like Barley Bending. And it's about how um, life has its ups and downs, but usually we bounce back and often rise back up. And that happens for me in the form of song. And that was what this poem is about. And over top of that, um, the part for the BC Girls Choir, which is going to be singing mm -hmm. on Friday as well, um, is a poem by a 10-year-old Japanese boy. Wow. Um, and... He describes some of the darkest, um, most terrifying fears that everybody has. And to see these put to words by a 10-year-old um, was quite striking to me. So I decided to set those in the children's choir voices and support them with the adults who who are constantly saying, mm -hmm. we'll rise again. Mm -hmm. um, and then the end of the song, I set the... I. Well, I set nonsense syllables to um, <laughs> a tune called The Wind That Shakes the Barley, which is an Irish fiddle tune. Mm -hmm. It's a reel and it's really fun. And the adults and the children join together on that. And that is, to me, the, the sorrow transformed into song. It's, it's a lot of fun. So despite, despite its, its darker undertones, it's, the piece is a lot of fun, I think. And I'm enjoying singing it. I think the I'm enjoying singing it. I'm enjoying singing both of your compositions. <laughs> Um, no. So, as uh, someone, you, you've just graduated with your um, Bachelor of Music and Composition from mm -hmm. UBC. Um, you've been published by a few <laughs> major choral organizations, uh, publishing um, companies. What do you see um, 
as the value in a program like the Young Composers Competition, mm-hmm. which has obviously helped you and, and many others, mm-hmm. but, but what, in your own words, do you think is the value of a, a program like this? I think having a choral competition in the city of Vancouver, um, where there are so many choirs and so many excellent choirs, um, is so valuable to young composers and audience members and to be fostering a new catalogue of choral music that starts right here in Vancouver. As a second year composition student, it's hard to get performances of large works and choral pieces require large groups to perform them. Mm-hmm. So uh, it's just so exciting when you're that young and you can go to a concert and hear your work performed by a professional choir. And um, it's, I think it's, it's invaluable and there are not many opportunities like that. And John in this competition programs all of the finalists in every category. Mm-hmm. It's a whole concert. It's, um, it's really remarkable and I think it's quite rare. Excellent. Well, thank you both for writing such wonderful compositions. We're looking forward to performing them. Once again, the Vancouver Chamber Choir is holding their youth and music concert on Friday, May 6th at Ryerson United Church in the heart of Carisdale. We'll also be joined, as Kathleen mentioned, by the BC Girls Choir, as well as Linda Lee Thomas on piano. Uh, the concert starts at 8 p.m. Tickets are available through Ticketmaster. Thank you once again. Thank Thank you.